brake system, truck malfunction, stability control malfunction, tyre pressure system malfunction. Right, this morning I'm on with ABS fault. We've got the ABS fault on this little daft. Uh, it's been to Ford and Slater. They said it was the, well, at first they said it was them involved there. So the lads have fitted down either side. Uh, and then obviously put new sensors in it. I just rang up my ABS lad and he says, uh, just click your sensor here and check for continuity. Go from there and go under your grill. It's as though there's been a bit of corrosion. Drinking. Oh, there, there we go. Oh, look at that lot, green lot. Looking promising. Oh, yeah, look. Could that be the culprit? It freaking might be. Huh. Oh. I'm gonna have to trace that fucking uh, ABS wire, innit? Well, it's just well, it's just that one. That one's the near, uh, the offside one. Because well, I got my wire going into there, disconnected the plug. Going on to my multimeter lock, and then if I put my other end of my multimeter, hear it. So we know that ain't got a break in it. I'll do it again to that one, but the fault, Daft said, is coming from the near side front. So I've still got to find this little bastard at the other end. Trying to find the other end of that bastard. Now it's black and brown because they're that put into it. It's definitely. Yeah, definitely black and brown. He's up in the chassis there. And then into that main loom there, which is the big fat loom. So now there should be a black and brown coming out of this big loom here. Must be hiding. Gonna have to take that off there. Just to see where it fucking goes, because it obviously doesn't go that way. It's gotta go that way, isn't it? Right, I'm gonna take it off. Look, it does go back, look. It goes back that way, look. I've just pulled it now, that wire up, and that wire's looped around there like that. So it went in that direction first, it went in the thing, eight in that direction, went in, looped around this wire here, and then doubled back on itself, going back there, look, to the back of the vehicle. Right, apparently both them front sensors, both of them, I know I've got a signal off that one up to the front bulkhead, I've just been speaking to Daft, they said, well, I don't know how you go off signal at the front bulkhead. It shouldn't go there. Both of them sensors lead to there. A4, A5, A6, and A7. Oh, I just took that plug out a lot, that top plug. I think that's it, because on there, it's got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then these top four are four, five, six, seven. So I bet the four, five, six, and seven are both front ABS seg sensor ones. Well, that's what I'm hoping anyway. I'm gonna put a bit of wire in there, in them, and then test see if we can see continuity between them. That's in number one. So then we go to the front here where the sensor is, and then, Put the multi-meter on. Yeah, beep, beep, beep. Oh, yeah, look. It goes down to that well there. Yeah, so that's all right. If these are gonna be all right, I'm gonna be fucking sick as a pig. Right, try a different one then. Right, try and pin number two now. Fuck all on that, unless it's on the other side. Let's try the other side, huh? No, fuck all. Well, I'll try pin number three. Not pin number three, that was pin number... First one was pin number four, what I tried, that got the signal. Number five, no signal. 
Now I'll put it on number six. Fuck off with that one either. Alright, I'm in pin number seven now. I don't really know what the fuck I'm doing here, really. I've already got it on pin number one, uh, pin number four. Now what do we do? Still don't make no sense, look, because there, black and white wires going into that plug. And obviously we know that the front, it's brown and black. So somewhere still it's changed. Oh, it's that bastard there, look. That's where it changes colour of it. Look, but that's her there, look. Look that, look, black shrouding, look, brown and black wire. So is that the one coming from the near side? Must be. But why haven't you got two fucking signals coming down to that plug? Well, I'll test them from here, Anna, making sure I've got power from there to the front there. Or I'll do it direct from here. I'll do that now. Oh, I've got my little wire in there. Yeah, so I've got that white wire in that plug now. And this is the end of it. Yeah, beeping. By right, now we'll check the other wire. Right, that was the brown wire, now I'm gonna check the black wire. <laughs> Fuck, no. Fuck all. Does that mean there's a break in the black wire then? By rights it does, doesn't it? Because that goes all the way to the end there. Black and brown, black and brown. So does that mean somewhere where it's flexing? Could be up here, look. It could be anywhere, couldn't it? But normally, you see, you get a break in a wire wherever something moves, obviously. Unless it's got... corroded or something. But obviously, where it moves, like around where the axle steers, You'd assume that's where the brake would be, wouldn't you? So do I cut it down up there and then try it? That's fucked anyway, isn't it? So I may as well do. Got no clues, have I? Right, this is my idea. Look, I have my sensor. There. Obviously that plugs into there, but... It, I wouldn't have thought it'd break in the chassis. So I'm going to chop it here and try it. Connect the... Try the power there. There, to the back. To the valve. This cable is plugged into that multi-plug. That, listen. So somewhere, somewhere between there and the plug there, there's a break. So all I need to do now is snip that, get a new one of these, plug into it, job's gonna. Right, I've joined her up there, look. With me, shrink connectors, then put a bit of nice insulation tape. So in like two years time, it can corrode like fuck. And then we can have the same problem again. But at least someone will see the tape and think, oh, I know where to look, where that fucking tape is though. Cause that's where the problem will be. Well, I'm just gonna test it again. Yeah, baby. Hear that little beep? That's the sweet sound of success. Dave said that the offside sensor goes to that thing down there, what I've checked on that plug near that air dryer, but I don't think it does. I think the offside one goes all the way up to the bulkhead, because I tested it, didn't I? And I got continuity there. And he said, the daft bloke said, well, I think it'll just be interference from somewhere else. But I don't think it is, because I tested that plug, didn't I, from there to here, and I got no signal back from it. So I think that one goes all the way up to that bulkhead there. And then obviously this near side one goes to the back of the air dryer the cable well i know it fucking goes there because that's where it does go it goes there look there's the little sensor cables at that near side front who would have thought now i've got to plug everything back in again i've got more plugs out wiring out and a little whew, plug it all back in again put the cab down and try it and if the lights are still on it might need resetting by uh plugging it in Fuck knows what that broken wire was. I don't know what that was, but we repaired it anyway. 
Right, everything's back together now. Blind man would be pleased to see it, wouldn't he? Now the moment of truth. Fingers crossed, boyos. Let's have a look, see what we've got. Fucking ABS fault still. Brake system truck malfunction. Oh, we've only got one fault, lot. Well, we've took two faults out. Huh? Well, I might have to go above 10k, so I have to take it for a for a test run. Hey, look at that! Well, these have got the fault done. Catch you on the next one, guys. See you later. Hey, little beauty. <laughs>